I'm getting there. Okay. Okay, so today we are doing something completely different. Me and my dad, we made a big vivarium thing. So we took a big, what is this called? Uh, it's a 275-gallon IBC tote thing of some sort that we've cut in half and left the bottom inside. So, I had him cut this out for me, then I had him weld it up here for like a door, and I don't have much stuff in here that I know of, but I have a few lizards, and some ants, some plants, I have a weird looking beetle thing, um, but the other day, before it was filled up with water and stuff, I came out here and I took a bunch of bricks and stuff and I built it up back there. It's underwater right now. And I built a big like wall up kind of and I put all that dirt and stuff on it. And earlier today I got some worms and stuff. Um, and I put in here. But I just kind of like put some plants in here and stuff. We ordered some other plants. Frog bite, frog, is that what it Yeah, is? we ordered some frog bit and some hornwort plants. Um, I know nothing about aquatic plants, but I did, uh, actually I was using chat GPT and that's what it recommended that we plant here in Indiana. Um, the goal is, I think he's wanting to keep this active through winter time. So um, we're gonna add some more water to it. We're gonna get these plants, once they come in, we'll get them rooted and started well. Um, and he's gonna be catching minnows, crawdads, whatever else, um, and adding to this. Let me just show you real quick where he's gonna catch everything from. Just go right over here, down in the holler, right here. That's the crick, he spends a lot of time down there. just playing doing whatever and he's uh yeah so Dayton is homeschooled um if you don't already know that here we go Let me spin around some there we go okay Dayton's homeschooled um he does an online program called a Cellus, and part of that is they had an ecology class an elementary ecology um, he took that this year and he's always been really interested in this stuff last year He had a little aquarium set up out on our porch and he would catch minnows and whatnot but uh, Yeah, he's been taking it a little bit farther this year and studying some ecology He's been watching a lot of uh, videos on YouTube about this stuff and ants Canada I don't know if you've seen that channel pretty neat stuff, but uh, yeah He's having some fun with it and more importantly. He's learning quite a bit what do you think, bud? I like it. Um, we're going to be doing a lot more stuff to this. Hang on just one second. There's a plane going over. Okay, there we go. So, as I was saying, we're going to be doing a lot more with this. Um, I don't have any fish yet put in here. But because of how dirty the water is and stuff. Because it is nasty. It was like terrible whenever I first filled this up. Um... I just, I have like a thing that I go in here and clean it out every now and then. We're going to end up building a filter for myself so I can clean this out um, and stuff so it isn't nasty whenever I put my fish in and maybe I'll be able to see them while they're in there. I'll show you guys this and yeah. That it? Yep. All right, go ahead and wrap her up, bud. Thanks for watching. I hope I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like and subscribe.